How's it going, my friends? This is Mark with Lab Tech and Toy, and today we're going to through the menu on the Pebble Smartwatch. Before we get into this menu, I just want to let you guys know that if you have a steel, it's going to be the same menu. It doesn't really matter. So, the first thing that we have in the menu after you push the center button on the right side of the watch is music. So, we can select that, and we have our reverse track play and fast forward see it says new music because my music app isn't running right now but if you're playing music and it was running that would be showing there and all that stuff so below that is notifications it will show you all your notifications you can select them scroll through them view all the information that you did on your normal lock screen type of thing but i just turned it on so i don't really have any notifications right now below that is alarms and keep in mind this sets them right on the pebble not on your device so we can set our hour, time, and AM, PM, all that stuff. So it'll vibrate and let us know. Below that is watch faces. And it shows us all the ones we pre have we have installed and which one selected. We can also back out. Well, I'll show you that in a minute, but we can select them right there. So it says simplicity, that's selected. We can back out to our home screen and see that right there. But we can also use up and down arrows and switch through that as well. So you can see I'm just changing through my watch faces by using those little um, up and down buttons. So below that is settings and we have Bluetooth and that just shows what device it's connected to and if it's connected or not. Below that is notifications so we can turn notifications on or off, do not disturb, enable or disable vibrations and choose our font size. For date and time, you can set our time if you don't want to do that. It says automatically based on your device. You can change it from 12 to 24 hours. For me, it was preset to 24, so I had to change that back to 12. I don't really know why that did that. Next, we have display. So backlight, when you push the buttons, the backlight will turn on. And for motion, when you shake it, the backlight will come on. If you turn that off like me, you just have to push that little back button when you're at your clock to turn your backlight on. For about, we get some information about the Pebble, firmware, recovery, bootloader, hardware, serial number, uptime, legal, all that stuff. And then we have shutdown. This will turn your watch off, save your battery life if you're not going to be wearing it during night or that. And we also have our factory reset. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys liked it, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe for uh, what's on my Pebble video. If you guys want that, leave a like as well. Questions, comments? You can leave those as well, and I'll see you in the next one.